Hello, hello there and welcome back to War Thunder and welcome to Napalm's newest news and this time we have the death block on the VFV or VFW, the German Ballista. This has striking similarities to something that I would call the death toaster of World of Tanks and it's been a long time since I played this but here we can read it by ourselves. It's an experimental World War II open top German heavy anti-air vehicle fitted with the powerful 88mm Flak 41 and there you can see that it seems like you can deploy the side armor platings and then you have uh, either a 360 degree uh, field of fire or um, when we look at this bench here in the back then it seems like 300, um, 135 degrees of field of fire to each side which is still very very excellent and if this mechanic will work we will see how it works if this then is the travel mode and this then is the stationary mode we'll have to see you can elevate the uh, gun to 90 degrees which is very nice and uh, yeah it is part of the battlefield engineer event another one at rank three for the chairmans with premium status so that is really nice and immediately you would think about something like the 88mm Flak 37 Selbstfaller fährt ja auf 18 Tonnen Zugkraftwagen with its excellent rate of fire or the Waffenträger Krupp Steyr mit Pack 43 and I think somewhere in that region we will have to see where the battle rating really is but I think it is way above 4.0 because this is more like a long 88, more on this in just a moment, rather than the Flak 37. According to Wikipedia, um, there you can see the data for yourself. Um, it is an L47.4. My, my calculations, according to, um, to the barrel length, of 6,293 millimeters divided by 88 millimeters goes to an L71. So I don't know where the truth lies. There might be some discrepancies, but I think it is not quite a long 88 in its overall performance. And um, yeah, um, the muscle velocity is also very interesting because it is a bit lower. It is a bit lower than the long 88, which has a thousand meters per second mass velocity. This is 980. So I think the penetration would, would be uh, roughly somewhere between 190 millimeter and 210 millimeters of penetration, um, depending on whatever statistics Gaijin are using, but still a very powerful gun, especially for rank three. So I think it is somewhere in between the Flakbus and the Waffenträger in its overall performance. Let's talk about the mobility. And uh, at first I thought this is a crossover between a Panzer IV and a Panther chassis. So uh, we have the unangled front plating and we have the interlocking road wheels. But I think that overall the armor will not exceed 50 millimeters anywhere and the side will be even thinner. The irony is that this is a heavy anti-air vehicle. However, there we can see that the crew has no protection. So obviously bombs, rockets and even machine gun fire can deal easily with this vehicle. And that's already it. Link to this death block in the video description down below. I expect this to be hyped. I expect this to be spammed out. I expect that this firepower will rule the battlefields for quite some time and it will be heavily traded on the marketplace as well. But at the end, it is not really something outstanding, something that will break the matter. It depends on how the uh, triangle of firepower, mobility and protection aka survivability really works out in the meta of War Thunder. It depends uh, what the enemies get as terms of counter, how the allied teams will adapt to it and how competent the German player base is in using this. And that's already it for me. So I hope you enjoyed this rather quick rundown on my thoughts on this German Ballista. Um, really nice looking. Um, I'm really uh, looking forward to how this mechanic works and yeah that's it already for me so thanks for watching thanks for listening please give this video a uh, like if you did subscribe if you want to see more uh, let me know in the comment section uh, if you like this format if you like this vehicle what do you think about the battlefield engineering event uh, so yeah as usual we'll see each other on the battlefields of war thunder mm -hmm.